Fox 5 Health News and a new stroke treatment being used at a local hospital that is getting amazing results. It really is, and we talked to one patient who had a major stroke just weeks ago, and wait until you see his remarkable recovery. Just hold it up. Good, you're doing great. That's amazing. That's amazing. Wow. Wow is right. Just three weeks ago, Robert Skibo had been doing some shopping when he suddenly fell to the ground. I couldn't move my left leg or arm to get up, and it wasn't good. Scary. It was scary. The 78-year-old was rushed to Lutheran Medical Center in Brooklyn, and he was having a stroke. Every second mattered. You suddenly lose blood flow to part of your brain. And when that happens, the, the clock starts ticking. And the longer that blood flow is not going to the brain, the more of a chance that you're going to remain permanently disabled. Dr. Jeffrey Farkas is the director of interventional neural radiology. He says Robert had a very large clot on his brain. So in addition to using a clot-busting drug, the stroke team used a new treatment that gets quicker results than similar devices already on the market. During the procedure, a catheter is threaded from the groin to the brain to suction out the clot. This new design of the catheter, called the 5 Max Ace, has really been revolutionary. Basically, this portion is in the patient's brain. And all we do is that we press that little green button there and turn on the suction, and any of the clots that are inside the brain get sucked through this catheter into, the, into this tubing here. Dr. Farkas says Lutheran Medical Center is only the second hospital in the U.S. to use this game-changing tool. Well, we're talking about the difference between going home to your family and either having an extended period of time in a nursing home or rehabilitation or maybe not going home at all. Dr. Farkas says Robert responded immediately to the treatment and with a little more time should be back to normal. If it wasn't for those guys, I'd be with the angels, maybe. They're great. Everybody was great. Yeah, Robert's so doing sweet. good. Yep. Well, joining us now is Dr. Manny. Thank you so much for being with us. Hey. Okay, so this uh, new this new tool is being called the next generation okay. of stroke treatment. So uh, why and what about it is so advanced? Well, just like you saw in the package, it's all about timing and going into the right center. This is a really an important technology, and I'm going to probably see this technology more and more in stroke centers around the tri-state area. It's all about being able to get there, um, you know, the doctors getting uh, the medication to kind of uh, anticoagulate the clot, and then uh, and with this particular device, they're able to do it so quickly, 17 minutes really to suction, to put the catheter through the groin and, ca and all the way to the level of the clot and then suction the clot out. Very important because it reduces the damage that you have in the brain. When you have a brain injury, it's always about the time. The longer the clot stays there, more dead tissue mm -hmm. occurs and of course more permanent damage so this is amazing and uh, you know I congratulate the hospital yep. for having it. Yeah, great job. You were talking about how important it is you know to be able to respond that way quickly when you're doing stroke treatment but also the word fast is really important when you're trying right. to identify someone who is having a stroke. Right. As you well. know, we talk about you know, learning the word fast. Yeah. You know, face, um, arm, weakness, uh, speech, and time. That's why the most important neurological signs and symptoms. If you're sitting at home watching TV and you have weakness of your arm, if you have, uh, if you see your face drooping, immediately time. Call 911. And many centers around the New York area, hospitals are prepared. What they call stroke centers, mm -hmm. emergency room areas where they have specialized people. They have an uh, emergency CAT scan right away so they can make the diagnosis and then they get the neurologist involved because yeah. time is, is of the essence and clearly the quicker you kind of treat a stroke then the better prognosis you have and then you're mm -hmm. able to go home. Some people and, feel like, you know what, and maybe I'll just wait and no, see. No, that's you know? the uh, worst maybe, thing you could do. The yeah. worst, you know, we, you know, we always say about, you know, don't go to the ER for unnecessary uh -huh. reasons but when you are talking about neurological signs and symptoms, right. you have to get there immediately. Thank you, we appreciate right. that. Yeah.